Hey, how's it going, everyone? Welcome back to another episode of The Tech It Realm. Today, what we're going to be doing is something very unique and special, and it's how to make an application for the App Store. How to make a free app. I've made an app right here, which you guys should totally go and check it out because it's free and everything. I'm not even charging you a single thing. Literally, all it is is just you can get my website up on there, my YouTube videos, every single thing you need in order to see some fresh, new, entertaining content every single day. But enough product placement for myself. I'm going to be showing you guys how to put an app on the App Store for 100% free. Now, this is the actual website where you're going to host the app. And this is where basically the, the company that's going to publish the app to the actual App Store. And as you can see right here, if you click on all features it'll basically give you a list of all the things that they're able to do what kind of an app they're able to make for you and um, yeah I mean there's just a whole bunch of stuff that you know that you could put inside your app right here you could put push notifications which is probably the best part video tutorials which is something I'm making right now isn't that funny but um, yeah I mean you have all this stuff right here on the on the left it's on the black category I'm not sure what the stuff on the right is it basically gives you a quick overview of the kind of things you'll be able to do you can publish it on Google Play too so it's not just the App Store okay so everyone on my you know all the people on it I'm not leaving you behind. You can put that on Google Play as well if you're interested in that. Now, basically, you're going to need an account, of course. So you're just going to go to the login button right here. Just click that. Now, what you are going to need for this is a website. Now, that may seem right off the bat, that may seem like really complex and a whole extra step that you don't want to do. But nowadays, you can make a website really quickly in like practically five minutes and for also 100% free as well. I can name a whole list of free website providers and basically what you're going to need a website for is because this is what's going to have all the content of your app. What this whole thing does, what this company does called App Notch is basically they go ahead and take the website and they, tra and they kind of transform it into app formation and uh, that's what pretty much turns into turns it into an app you could use wix weebly wordpress there's websitemaker.com i think that's one of them and then of course for the domain you could do either um godaddy or just you could use a free domain from either wix weebly or something like that and i'm gonna give you a brief explanation of what that would look like all right so i just made this website and it took literally like five minutes now of course you don't have to worry about actually putting it into a certain um format because that's what they're gonna do for you and then all you got to do is just go right here, press publish once you're finished with it. Um, and this works for Weebly, Wix, anything you use really. And then just click uh, control C or just copy and then head over back into here while you're signing up. Just pray, paste that right there. And then once again, type in your email address. And that's really all that there is to do. And then type in your phone number press send me my app now after that you are going to have to do some more sign up procedures and it's going to simply ask you some questions of course and there's going to be some customization factors because you know it's not just going to you know th it's not just as simple of course i mean it's going to have to ask you in what way you want to publish it and stuff like that and through what company and just what you know your branding of the app is going to be as you can see it's finally loading it's going to give you a brief presentation of what the app's going to be like and it'll give you a list like right here um it'll yeah like right here it, it will submit your app to the app store for you your it'll uh, it'll automatically update you could just update it straight from here the browser and then you can click customize your app publish your app to the app store in three easy steps of course this is where you're going to publish it as you can see you have you have all the um options down here you can change certain hot tabs right there customize your app and this is a really easy format obviously with my app it isn't like this easy because whenever I have to edit my app I have to go through my own website I have to edit the website completely and I have to do a lot of HTML editing and stuff like that but for you if you're using like a free website maker like weebly.com then it should be really easy for you to just customize it you just customize it right through here and then once you're done you just press submit but it's gonna have to give you a, a quick preview of course uh, where they're going to you know review the app make sure it's appropriate for the app store you will have to send your app in for a preview because um, you know you have to test things make sure it's working properly this right here is called the app download you could you could basically send a test SMS um, I'm pretty sure that's what it is and you get the app simulator to make sure it's everything that you want obviously you don't have to have the app notch thing on top of the app that's just something that you can that's that's what the free version of course um, if you want the paid version then you, you could get rid of all the the logo around the logos and stuff around it 
you can do test push notic push notifications what that basically is is just you know when you get those annoying rings on your phone for subway surfers or something that's a push notification write the title message you can even put a url down there you just press send of course, there's nothing to send it to, so I'm not going to do that. And then, of course, before you like actually publish it to the App Store, it will ask you to fix a lot of things, like step three. Um, you know, just for me, like I have to add the the app icon and stuff like that, and screenshots, and email address, and password, short description for the app, and that goes for Android and the Apple Store and stuff like that. But once you get all that stuff, you can activate your app, and with a free version, you can get it down. On the app store within a couple days i believe and then you can get your reviews going and share it with your with all your friends family and pets and everything it'll just be fun won't it you have your own app and that's something that not many people will be able to say and you'll be the coolest kid in school so and if this did help you and if you did enjoy please make sure you just go ahead and obliterate the like button and then i will see you guys in the next one goodbye